Hi Amanda. Hi. Nick with Temple of Geek. We we are at oh, the right I place. Great stuff, by the way. We're just putting you down the floor. I was like, oh my god, everyone's amazing. This has been fantastic yeah. looking at everybody. So first off, the first season was been a huge success. How's that been for you? That's been so exciting. It was such a labor of love to make, you know, the show and to be able to put the stories that we wanted to see out into the world. And then other people liked it. Like how amazing is that? To like something you love so much other people like. It's it's been fantastic. I mean, one of the standout aspects of it has been the writing, the fact that we get so involved in the characters and the story itself. Um, what did you try to bring to this project for yourself in, in the writing? I think, so I, I think we were always trying to tell a story that felt like it was coming from the characters, like they were making decisions people would make, even though it's a crazy world, there's magic, and it's it's this huge, there's monsters, and there's things that normal people don't actually deal with. We always wanted why they made their decisions, their motives to feel like reasons people, you know, it was always like, is it because of love? Is it because of fear? Is it because of hope? Is it because of family? Like, why do people do these things? Do they gotta be the same reasons we do the things we do. Um, and so that's kind of where we always started. And then we dressed it up in all the fun. And, you know, I think every day we were just like, what do we love? Why do we love it? What makes, you know, can we, can we do our version of that in this show? You know, and I think we all really did and were happy with it. And then other people liked it too. Is there a particular character that you connected with most? I actually, it was Caitlin. You know, yeah. she, she's such a, she has such a, personal place in my heart because I got to give her her last name, I got to give her her parents, things she didn't have in the game. And then, you know, she was always driven by, you know, trying to make a name for herself apart from her family. Like, she didn't have to do that, but she worked really hard to get where she wanted to go. And I was like, oh yeah, I totally just had a mission and was trying to get there my whole life. And so that sort of motivation I could identify with a lot. Thank you so much. I appreciate yeah, your time. Of